Angela. I'm David. And I'm Simran. This week's question is, my friends always want to study with me, but I know I get more done on my own. What should I say to them? I think you should just be completely honest with them and say, like, hey, I, like, cannot study with you because it's so difficult to, like, concentrate and I get distracted, but not in a bad way. You know, like, so say it nicely and, like, just let them know that you actually do have a good time with them, but that it's hard for them, hard for you to concentrate because you have to do work and you do better uh, studying by yourself. Yeah, I've definitely been um, a little bit too nice, and sometimes mm -hmm. I'll say, you know, I'm just going to be studying at home or something like that, and then I end up running into them in the library. So there can, <laughs> there can definitely be, like, awkward moments if you try to, if you try to, like, maneuver your way out. Because um, that's, like, the most awkward feeling. Then you got to yeah. some, say something like, oh, I changed my mind or something like that. So, yeah, yeah definitely, like what Angela said, just be honest. Um, I feel like you can also, like, maybe budget your time and account for the fact that you get less with your friends. Like, if you know that, It'll be really awkward. You don't want to lie to them. You can say, "Yeah, I'm gonna to try to do notes, and I'm trying to I'm gonna to try to watch the lectures again, but maybe right before the test, you and I can go over flashcards." Or you could say something like, "Yeah, I, I feel like I'm gonna get more done if I just lock myself in my apartment and study, but maybe we can go out and eat after the test or um, something like that." You want to be honest with them and say, "Hey, I gotta put my you know my grades first. I need mm -hmm. to." I need to study a lot, but it's not because I don't like you. I want to spend time with you. It's just a personal preference. Yeah. And you can also um, tell your friend that, hey, let's set breaks, um, yeah. in which we can just like talk during those breaks yeah. specifically, and then spend like an hour doing your work. Mm -hmm. I think that can be helpful as well. Yeah, delegating like specific time periods where we're going to do this, and then exactly take the break, and then maybe go off for watch your dinner right. after that yeah just give, if you give yourself the breaks and plan the breaks then i think they're much more inclined to um to study when mm -hmm. you're supposed to study hi everyone thanks for watching feel free to comment down below if you have any questions and we'll try to answer it in the next video make sure you follow be well cal on facebook and instagram stay, stay thirsty, thirsty.